welcome back to the DBS studios. Our phones have been ringing all, or, already and we're going to go actually straight to the phone lines to give you an opportunity. So, hello, welcome to Dulo Factor Live. Oh, sorry, we got to you. We got to try to get to you as soon as we could. A long break, I'm afraid. So perhaps you can give us a call back. Of course, the telephone lines are open now. So if you have any comments about anything that you've heard tonight, um, then please uh, let us know. Whatever it is that you want to speak about, uh, whether it's men, women, the way that we compare um, our communications, just let us know. And uh, also, just let me remind you that tonight's giveaways, how many channels do you get when you sign up for Carib Cable's basic package? Uh, in addition to 350,000 loyalty points what will the winner of the Super J IGA's It's Time for Hope to Shine Easter promotion win also in the Facebook component of the Super J IGA and TJ's It's Time for Hope to Shine Easter promotion how does one qualify as I said we're taking your calls now so if you'd like to respond to anything that OGB Chris Thea and Valerie said this is the time to do it and while you're doing that let me just uh, read some of the emails that have actually come through already um, a lot of people are concentrating on the, the gossiping issue um, long ago it used to be women now it is men who have time to gossip all they do is sit at bars uh, at the roadside and gossip women now are busy finding ways to make money they are also busy educating themselves and becoming successful. Uh, here's another one. Generally men talk less because they can't keep a conversation for less than five minutes. Um, my husband just said someone just told me women gossip and men argue and criticize. Okay uh, another one. We men like to bad talk women uh, but truth is we can't do without them. Uh, the bus drivers gossip more and women gossip also but men overdo it because when they're sleeping with someone they have to inform people. There's some, there are lots and lots and lots, and I can't really read out all the paragraphs, all right? Um, but as I said, the phone lines are open if you have any questions or any statements that you'd like to make. Now, I know there were a couple of things within what, we, what was spoken at Obej, and you both had Thea very upset and irate about some of the things that you said. Um, and particularly, I wrote one down when we talked about which sex was more <coughs> forgiving. You know, that's a very important thing, you know, having a sex who is, you know, when you're in a relationship, things don't always go right do they? So is it a fair comment to ask which sex is, is more forgiving? What do you say, uh, OGB? Yes, it's, it's, it's fair, but the only thing is that, um, like I mentioned, um, men are more forgiving because they're more tolerable. But women, I'm not saying that women don't, for, don't forgive, forgive, right? But they do. But they don't give you, some of them might not even give you a second chance. But a man can tolerate you as many times and I can still let you in. But the woman might give you first chance, second time, does it? And whenever they let go, they will never take go back. Chris? Um, I think um, women are more um, uh, forgiving on, 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 on this one, um, uh, more than um, what men are. Um, I think they, um, they, they tend to tolerate um, a lot more than, um, than uh, we as males um, do. So. Mm -hmm. For women, give them this one. Okay, so you, you, you're disagreeing yeah. on this one. Mm. All right, I mean, I know that's a big thing because uh, every case is different and there are different reasons why one would forgive, but let's just go to the, the phone lines. Hello, yeah. welcome to Dulo Factor Live. Good night. Good, Good night. How are you? Fine, thank you. I'm so mad I missed that session on Sunday, that's Leah. So we didn't, can, would you mind repeating that? I didn't I hear that said, today. I'm so mad I missed that session on Sunday. This is Leah. Oh, hi, Leah. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure you would have had a lot to say. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, that's a nice topic. But on the question of men gossiping, I wouldn't say that men gossip more than women. Mm -mm. Because you see, men when they sit at a bar, they talk a lot about women, they talk a lot, a lot about sex and so on. But they're not really gossiping. They, 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 they bring conversation about it, they talk about it, but not to say gossiping. Unlike women, they would say, you didn't see her. And you know, I mean, they, they really get into people's business. And you really call that gossiping. But men, they talk a lot about, you know, <laughs> things. But they don't really gossip about people's business like women. I wouldn't say men gossip a lot. You know, and I, I believe that women are more forgiving than men. Okay. Women are more forgiving. We, we take a lot before we really, you know, we forgive a lot. Men, <laughs> the first instance you make a mistake... They can handle it. They're not ready to forgive, but women always forgive and give them another chance. So women forgive more than men any day. 
All right, that's, Leah. That's my take on it. Thank you so much for You're that. Welcome. I, I have to agree with Leah there. Uh, I do think that women do forgive, um, generally speaking, more than men. But yeah. I think that the, the fault that we have as women <coughs> is that we say that we forgive. But in order to forgive, you actually have to, I wouldn't say forget, but you mustn't throw it back. And I think that's one of our weaknesses as women. We'll, we will forgive, we will take you back, but then when you, as soon as you do something wrong, you throw it back in I'll, the man's I'll, face. I'll, and I'll, I think I'll that is wrong. That. Would that you is, agree yeah. with that? Yes, yes that's that's what, I think there's no, there's no, um, no doubt about that. That's, um, that. that's true. Okay, let's go back to the phone lines. Thank you for calling to Law Factor Live. Yes, um, Professor? Yes, you're okay. live. Okay, um, and the point of unforgiveness, I think um, men are more forgiving. Because uh, we started from the beginning, or if an Adam forgive, forgive is, and that uh, we do, um, from the point of view, I think men are more forgiving because we, because of a different, but they choose to stay with uh, the, the person. So that means men are more forgiving, I think. I'll agree with that caller. Mm -hmm. yeah. Well, thank you for letting us know that, but I disagree with you. We agree with you. We agree. Okay. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Women will say they're forgiving you, but they'll keep it at the back. They'll keep it behind. Anything you do, they'll bring it back again. Yeah. I use that against you. Yeah. So it means they've not forgiven you. No, yeah, I understand that. But I, I, I do take the point. I do think that when men forgive, okay. they're likely not to throw it back in your face. Yes. All right, Carla, thank you so yeah. much for contributing tonight. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I think that, that, I mean, that is a valid point. And when you look at, uh, we're talking about relationships here, but I think even if you look at a woman with her child or children, she is sooner likely to forgive if a child does something wrong than perhaps mm -hmm. the father, I think, mm -hmm. you know. Yes. Uh, but again, the pattern for the woman is she will keep on reminding, mm -hmm. which may indicate that she hasn't forgiven. It may indicate that, and yes. I think that's where we need to kind of tighten up women. Yeah. Chris, do you have something in your mind? Um, no, I, I agree with that. I mean, yeah. there's, there's no, there's no um, disagreement with that at all. Okay. Yeah. So, um, all right, let's go back to the phones. Hello, welcome to the show. Thank you for calling. Uh, hello, good night. Good night. Julia, that's Valerie speaking. Hi, Valerie. How are you? Okay. Good. Now you have the men sitting here. They won't give you a word edgeways on Sunday. No. Tell them how you're feeling right now. I disagree with OBG and Chris. <laughs> <laughs> when, he's, when they um, said, like, um, women, like men don't talk more about women. Well, when they said uh, men more talk, um, women talking a lot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But you see when men in the bars and the barber shop. Mm -hmm or on the street, wherever they are, they will talk more about women. Oh, JB yeah. wants to respond? Okay. okay. Yes. Um, yeah. Barry, let me tell you, when sometimes look at things, right? Gossiping and bragging. Oh, I'm looking at... Oh, Yeah, I'm look, Yeah, uh, that's what I'm telling you. When men sit probably at a bar or barbershop, is that they're talking about football? Or when they talk about women, it's like they are bragging what they've done, not gossiping. They can tell you, see, I've done that, <laughs> I've shattered that lady, you know, I got this girl. It's bragging, it's not gossiping. <laughs> and you it, understand? And it, it, doesn't, it doesn't continue. Yeah. It, we're, 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 whereas with a women's conversation, it, mm -hmm. it will go on and on and on. Mm -hmm. And there's no stopping them. Yeah. Um, yeah. And when you um, women are more forgiving than men. Um, well, they've given an opinion we, we, on we, that. We, 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 yeah. we, we, we've we're passed on that one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We, we, well, we, we still say men are. Because <laughs> we don't bring it back up again. Mm -hmm. You know, Valerie, all I can say to you is, and I know you're a very sensible young lady, you will know that you would not want to date any of these gentlemen <laughs> on, the, on the set, would you? Because then they, yeah, they say they're, they're forgiving. <laughs> all right, but Valerie, th thank you so much yeah. for spending time with us on Sunday and for calling in tonight. Have a pleasant you're Easter. Welcome, Julia. Okay, see you. Now, you know, people, um, before we, we go to the break, I just want to tell you that 
we are talking generally here. You know, every case is different. And but as we go to the break, I want to just read you something, just in case you're wondering what is happening here. Um, someone says here, hi, Delia, and good night to your gorgeous guests. I can't stop laughing, but is it April's Fools tonight? Last time I checked, it was March 28th. It's evident that both your guests are egotistical and chauvinistic. Their comments are not to be taken seriously. Wait. Are they serious? <laughs> Men talk so much, they can't see what's happening under their very noses. And the most ridiculous thing, they drink to enhance their talking and reduce their senses and logics. <laughs> I think she's kind of summarized that. I mean, um, literally, you can take us seriously for some of the things. But I mean, when you sit down with your friends and you, you converse, I mean, you know which ones to take us serious. But I think that on the whole, uh, as the sexes, I think most people would agree that women um, are more forgiven than men. That being said, <laughs> yes. we're due for the commercial yeah. break. Yes. Stay with us on DBS. We'll be back quite soon. She would say that. Would she?